Rolling community coming together today to honor a fallen police officer. This was the 8th annual Rodney Holder Memorial Blood Drive. Yeah, and KRBC proud to be a part of the event and even more proud of this year's turnout. The goal, 250 donations in 12 hours. And thanks to you, this year the record was broken. 283 people donating blood. KRBC's Kelsey Pittman sharing tonight the positive impact that it's making right here in Abilene. When you give blood, you give life. This doesn't just honor Rodney, this honors everybody who may receive this blood. It truly is life giving. Fallen Abilene police officer Rodney Holder killed in the line of duty in 2010. I'd help him roll his police motorcycle out. He was trying to pull over a speeding driver when another pulled out in front of him, ejecting him from his motorcycle. His son Kyler says he will always remember how much his dad lived to ride. I'd help him like check the lights and the siren and stuff and then I'd always get to push the start button and then I gave him a hug and a kiss and watched him roll off every day. But that wasn't Holder's only love. Kyler says his dad donated more than two gallons of blood in his lifetime to the blood center. Donating blood was very important to him and so it's great that we're able to continue this blood drive um, in his honor. And it's that commitment to giving life that sparked the idea of an annual blood drive. Fast forward a few years and now it's grown to be a friendly competition between the guns, the Abilene Police Department and the hoses, the Abilene Fire Department. You want to donate for police? Yes, obviously. Or hoses? No, clearly. Uh, but either way, your your blood will be taken and uh, ultimately you'll have a chance to save, save a life. I don't really know why you need much, uh, I guess, enticing to come vote for hoses. I mean, <laughs> this is what we do. We save lives, so come join us. And now the Abilene community comes together each year to give. I want to know if there's a family member or somebody that needs the donation, then I can say who it's for. Honoring a life while saving lives throughout the big country. To everyone that came out here and supported us and donated blood from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much. It really means a lot, and you're helping to save many, many lives. In Abilene, Kelsey Pittman, KRBC, Abilene's Local News. Kelsey, thank you. Definitely a remarkable turnout this year. So we want to know who won. Well, by 13 donations, the guns taking the title this year surely cannot wait to see how the turnout is next year.